Ooh, two-man party. I'm gonna rock some shit. That was, uh, underwhelming. How come nothing is ever just whelming? I hear my cat meowing in the distance. Probably wants to go outside. Not happening. <clears throat> okay, so I missed a chest somewhere. Presumably up towards here. Before going in, no. I would have thought it was on that little railing I just ran across, but it was not. Didn't already get it and it was empty, was it? Or not empty, but something I already have. There's multiple pathways here. Stop doing that! What's that sound? It's Bell. Kurogami. He oh. must be forging another sword. He certainly is. The old fellow's forging himself into a blade. He's turning himself into a sword? He can do that? Is that possible? Who knows? Either way, it's what he decided to do. We had one last drink together. You'd go Just that far to neck. defeat Shigure and Stormhowl. I would. I'll turn a friend into a sword to kill my own brother. I'm a jerk. I'm in no position to judge. I think you are. Whatever you may look like, you're human. You hate because you love, and feel as much hurt as you do anger. That's human. <laughs> Kurogane is with me. He agreed to it. What our blacksmith friend feels towards Stormhowl is more than resentment. It's admiration, too. That's why he wanted to do it. He wanted to put everything he had into one final clash. Shigure is the same. He has that very human strength to take the good along with the bad and just keep pushing ahead. A strength that I, as a demon, can never match. Brooding doesn't suit you, Rokuro. You wanted to be a swordsman greater than any other. That's why you fought and bled to perfect your skills. That's the sort of man you are. <sighs> yep. That's who I am. I like that part of you, Rokuro. Me too. Thanks. I can kill people, but can't have a drink. 19 is far too young to have a drink. I'll let the 13 year old me.
Writing another letter to your sister? Nope. This time she sent one to him. <laughs> Man, she hardly ever writes back. Hope this ain't a bad omen. Shut it. Aizen, that's great news. I told her about all of you in my last letter. Seems she was amused. Says you sound appropriate for me, and she'd love to meet you. Weird sister you've got. You don't know the half of it. <laughs> a girl weird enough to want to live alongside the Reaper, no matter the cost. I'd love to meet her, too. I'll warn you. Touch my sister and I'll kill you. Right? Sheesh, you say that to every guy you meet. Awfully protective. Nah, just obsessed. That's even worse. Yeah. We'll all go meet her together someday. I like your confidence. Yeah, I man the wheel of my own ship. Writers of this game love predictable I, plot lines and incest. I. And all of you. And even her. Velvet's got a thing for her aborted nephew. There's the brother-sister thing going on with uh, Aizen and Edna. And then uh, the exorcist brother and sister. Huh. All about that wind sus. Yeah, last time you were on a secret mission, you were reporting back to the Abbey on us, so... That doesn't instill confidence. 98, 99, 100! Ready or not, here I come! Jump off now. Okay, gonna find you! Having fun? insisted that we play, so... Madam Eleanor! I followed Kamalana for you. She's hiding right over there. Wow. Cheating against a kid? That's low. I didn't! Bad Bianfu! No cheating! Huh? But when I play with Miss Maki Lu, she always makes me do that! She's a terrible influence on you. Eleanor! What? I found you, Kamalana! And Dial! What? No fair! See? That fucking hate cheat. that kid's voice. I simply utilize Bianfu's cheating. That's called strategy. <laughs> Plans must be solid and reactions flexible, right? Right. See, Kamalana? I'm smart and strong. You don't have to worry about me. Don't worry. Why am I the bad guy now? I can handle Bianfu, too. Don't worry. I'll make sure everyone makes it back safe. Okay. Come on, Anna. If you're feeling better now, head back, okay? It's too cold. You'll go into hibernation. No sleep! I'm not a crocodile. I'm a lizard. Isn't that... Not even close! You think crocodiles can regrow their tails? It has to be possible. There must be a way to make a better world for everyone. Humans, demons, Malakim, and I intend to find it. It might take years. No, decades, centuries, generations. Even if it takes me millennia, I'll do it. It takes crocodile tails Playing really seriously. Game, I take it. I believe in you, Eleanor. You'll find a way. I will. Once I've made up my mind, nothing can stop me. Yep. Trust me, we know.
What is this? Waiting on the wrong thing. God damn it. Okay. Let's see how that's looking online. Yep. It's playing OBS instead of the game. That's annoying. I'm gonna make it not do that. And the broadcast started again. Oh, control alt L. There we go. That fixed it. Double check on the caffeine site that that worked. Yep, it worked. Cool. Lord of Calamity, your schemes are your own business. Damn right, so butt out. But I won't stand by if Kamawana's fate is involved. It's a bit late for that. If you mean to stop me, you'll have to strike me down first. You asked for it. Ugh. Hey, kitten. I found an inn with a nice big hot spring. Warm yourself up before you catch cold. What a darling you are! I'll take you up on that. Gotta conserve my strength! Good idea. Fee, want to join me? What? No, no way! You're sitting in the sun. No need to hold back on my account. The bath at the inn should be huge. That's not the problem! Achoo! See? Hurry up and get in. I'll bathe alone, thank you. You go first. Fine, fine. Weird. Fucking weird. <gasps> what is it? Just a little errand. Watch these folks for a bit, alright? Looks like you got our message. You plan on awakening the four Empyreans? Age hasn't dulled your wits, I see. Surely you know the consequences. You know the chaos you will bring if you take that route. Oh yeah, so much chaos. You know me not amplified resonance will return to normal, the Malachim will regain free will. Many exorcists will lose their power to do whatever they do, and the Abbey will lose its means of control. While the demon threat will remain unchanged. Not only that, but the elemental balance of this world will be thrown into turmoil for hundreds of years. Earth will shift, skies will go mad, seas will swell, volcanoes will erupt. It'll be quite a show. All of civilization will regress. The eruption of Mount Killerus alone will rob humanity of its source of flamestone and consequently of gunpowder. Mmm, sounds fun. Hey, don't worry about it. I'm sure mankind will think of something. Go humans! Right? Just what do you think humans are? The wellspring of all malevolence. Thus must emotion be quelled. And reason bring order to the world, until the day that humanity can repent and overcome their sins. I get that right? You did. You know me not was awakened for that very purpose. We are the instruments of change. 
hated for our sacrifice. We are the shadow of the shepherd who brings salvation. Will you not return to our side? You still seem to think of yourself as a maven. I can think of nothing more boring than your ideal world. It is a world of purity. A garden of fake flowers. Good for show and nothing else. It's a world of order built on righteous ideals. Those ideals are twisted! Can a flower hold beauty if it does not wilt? Can a wolf be satisfied eating grass? The thought makes me rich, as do those who wish for it, and those content to live in shackles! Let the biting bugs go ahead and eat what they want to eat. Let the weeds grow where they want to grow! Some may look down on them and scoff at their foolishness, but their unwavering wills are proof that they're alive! If that's what you call evil, then I will live and die with evil as my mantra! Then I have no choice but to crush you. Used to treating people as bugs, aren't you? We got your back, Magilu. Wait. Now is not the time. His life belongs to the Lord of Calamity. Melchior Maven, I'll see you at the volcano. Don't you worry. I'll be sure to be there as you breathe your last. Very well. It will save me the trouble of having to crush you one by one. You haven't changed at all, Master. Fire. Ah, oh, what a nice bath. How was the men's side? Uh, not bad. I feel warmer now. Hmm? Your face is all red. In there too long? Uh, uh, no, um, I feel fine. <clears throat> oh. You mind? Help me comb my hair. Can I? Yes, please. <clears throat> oh. <gasps> Be careful, okay? I can't contain it. Oh. Mm. You know something, Velvet? Your hair is really beautiful. Oh. You know, that power that I have... If I could master the Silver Flame... I might be able to turn you back into a human. A human, huh? If we ever had a chance to start over, I'd love to cook for you every day. My quiches are much better than anything they sell in the stores. Okay, then I'll fetch the water and chop the firewood. <laughs> All by yourself? Of course! I'm gonna get a lot taller soon, and I'm gonna get stronger too. Yes, you will. I know you will. Great! Then I'll start looking for a way to master- No. Uh. It's too late. I've made too many sacrifices. Too many to ever come back from. I can't. But Velvet... Even worse, I haven't stopped. I'm willing to sacrifice others to keep going forward. If we kill Inomi not, what will happen to the Therians who are part of him? Will they return to normal? Well... It's likely that they'll all die. I know it. I dug my own grave. But what about Kamoana and Medissa? Uh. More importantly, what about you, Fee? You are connected to him. Uh. I know I might die if I go through with this, 
But still, I have to do it. Even if it means I have to sacrifice everyone that I know, even you who saved me. The Lord of Calamity isn't a demon lord. She's just a selfish, horrible girl. I have something to confess. <laughs> I... I don't like being called Fee. I really don't. <gasps> I think that name's too childish. Luffy said the same thing to me. I'm sure that he did. Though that you really don't understand boys at all. Yeah, you're right, I'm sorry. It's okay. Forgive you. <laughs> Thank you, Luffy said. Pretty lame. Is Velvet in there? Uh, yeah, but now's not the best time. I have an incest time with her aborted nephew. I'm here. Dry up. Break time's over. The Leggets have arrived. Yeah. Yeah. Another Scarlet Night. Losing your nerve, Velvet? I think not. Don't worry. Leave Shigure to me. Where's Kurogane? Here with me. Kurogane and I will cut Shigure down. And Aizen. Sorry, but Melchior is mine to eat. Got it. Got it. But at the very least, you're gonna let me watch. He likes to watch. Magilu, you do whatever you want. Go nuts out there. I'm always nuts! Benwick, when you see your chance, take the others back to the Von Eltia and await orders. Aye, aye. Luffy said. Let's go. Eleanor, keep Luffy set safe, please. I will. Worry not. Let's move. We go to kill the Exorcist Legates and engulf this world in the flames of chaos. All right. A little melodramatic. Have a good trip. Ugh, shut up! Don't worry, uh. Kamawana. There's nothing to fear here. Fear? It's just us here. <laughs> All right. I guess I'll tell you. All right. Velvet and her friends left to go fight one last battle. It's right a here. really important fight. For you, for me. And for everyone in the whole wide world. How important? More than I can even imagine. And right now, nobody knows how it'll go. Or what will happen afterward. That sounds scary. It is. That... But it just feels strange to do that. Strange? Down to that shitty well, little plastic motorcycle going by. Take away still less annoying than Kamalana. <laughs> That's silly. Yeah, I think he would. I think I understand. Don't worry. And so are Dial? Kamawana. Or... No. I think I can count on all of you more than I can that god at this point. Thank you, sweetie. <laughs> <laughs> but if I'm ever... I know she will. You're right. Your mother will protect you. He's dead. Yep. Oh, Kamawana. Surely there's some way we can save Kamawana and the others. That. I couldn't tell you. 
I just feel like I have to do something for Kamalana. Put her out of her misery. How about that? Put her out of my misery. An awful character. One of these chests regenerated. Hey, teacher. You managed to decipher what the ancient book had to say about Inomi Nat's awakening, didn't you? Right after we escaped from Titania, yes. I'm just sorry it wasn't of much use to you. Oh, come on, Grim. I'd say it turned out all right. That's not for you to decide. You're not seriously blaming Grim for all that. No, I'm not. But I'd still like to know anything more specific about Inomi Nat. Please, tell us what you've learned. All right. What Inomi Nat needs to fully awaken isn't a large quantity of malevolence, but rather the quality of oh it. Oh my god. Eight types. Specifically, I'm go out there and kick this dude off despair, his fucking motorcycle hatred, if he passes by greed, again. Greed, conceit, lust, obsession, cowardice, and selfishness. If each was assigned to a single Therian, then Velvet would be hatred and Kamawana greed, right? Medissa would be conceit. Teresa is lust. And Orthrus... Obsession? And cowardice for Griffin. That leaves the Rhino Stagros with selfishness. But Artorius was trying to steal despair from me. How does that fit in? Eight types of malevolence and only seven Therians. It definitely doesn't add up. Whatever the case, it seems obtaining this eighth malevolence is the final obstacle before Inominot's full awakening. I see. That would certainly explain Artorius' behavior. His plan was to foster profound hatred within Velvet, before plunging her into despair. And he used her brother to do it. If that's true, gathering all the Therians served a greater purpose. Right now, the Abbey has no means to collect despair. But with Teresa dead, shouldn't a new Therian have taken her place? Yeah, but after we killed her, the Abbey still went out of their way to try to capture me. That must mean they haven't been able to secure the new Therian. And even if they did, it wouldn't have despair. That's a good point. Artorius spent three long years trying to foster the despair within you. If that is indeed the specific type of malevolence Inomi not needs, it must not be something one can find overnight. Right. We need to attack while there's still time. Indeed. Yet... Is something troubling you? Yes. It comes down to the very idea of quality where malevolence is concerned. When you talk about the relative quality of something, what you're really talking about is its purity. That would mean that Therians pick out and devour this pure malevolence. Yeah. But malevolence by its very nature is impure. Therefore, for some person or creature to become a Therian, they'd need to be responsive to a purity of impurity. Surely few could ever meet such a stringent criterion. So we don't need to worry so much? Oh, but I think I know someone who fits that description. Perhaps a certain succession of top exorcists who have tried to suppress and purify the spread of malevolence. You don't mean... It's just a concern. For now, at least. I don't like that they made Griffin cowardice, birds of prey, or apex predators. They don't have a reason to be cowards. Doesn't make sense. But hey, a lot of shit in this game don't make sense. A merchant friend who works with the Abbey told me about this one weird Class 4 island. Some exorcists went there, and when they came back, they were laid up in bed, having awful nightmares and saying strange things oh, in their I'm sleep. Dead? What sort of things? Stuff like the walls moving and attacking them. Fairies flying in front of them. All kinds of weird. Couldn't those just be demons they saw there? Hey, I ain't done. Towards the end, they were talking about not wanting to see people's backs, that they hated them. They hated backs? What could that mean? I don't know. That's what makes it so strange. Maybe they saw the back of some demon on the island, and they don't want to be reminded. Your guess is as good as mine. But if you do decide to go, 
You'd best watch your backs. Except that I can't. If only I could just use my power to seal Inominat. Looks like you're raring to go, eh, Lafayette? Just don't be too eager to help, okay? You've got a bad habit of trying to play the good guy. Oh no, I'm not a good guy. I'm a selfish, wicked little boy. Oh, is that so? But if you acknowledge your own selfishness, then it's something you've chosen for yourself, right? Yeah. Then we have that in common. Now, all that's left is to follow your own creed. Only that. Besides, I'm a demon. Even if you were the worst of the worst, I'd be like, cool. Thanks, Aizen. Thanks, Rokuro. <sighs> Velvet. Don't give up on Lafayette set just yet, okay? So, you were eavesdropping on us at the inn. Heavens! I never knew a Praetor to be so utterly shameless! Uh, all right, I was. But that's not what I'm trying to say here. What I'm trying to say is... I know. No matter how selfish you are, life's empty without anyone to share it with. Correct. She's got a point. More than anything, I don't want to give up. Not on myself. Oh, calm down. It's just steam. Really? Oh, I get it. Mount Killeros is melting the bottom of the glacier. Of course, of course. The heat and the cold are engaged in a feudal war. Just like someone I know. Why not worry about the path you're taking? The path I'm taking? Oh, hot! Wait, beneath this ice... Is boiling hot water. How can you be so calm right now? One false step and we're poached! Probably. If you don't slip, you won't die. For the Reaper, you're certainly optimistic. <laughs> Where's that famous apathy of yours today, Mogilu? <laughs> Who cares about apathy? Especially when I got friends as depraved as you. The sky... The snow... It's all red. So this is a Scarlet Knight. That's the Pretty Scarlet strange, part. Isn't it? It's amazing. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's not like I'm happy about it or anything. If you're worried about Luffy or Celica, you don't need to be. I was just wondering what makes the moon turn so red. They say the Crimson Moon is a gate to beyond, and is proof of humanity's sins. A sign of sin, huh? Maybe the moon drinks up the innocent blood spilled by the wicked. My, it would take a wicked mind indeed to come up with something like that. Please, don't say such frightening things. A scarlet night occurs whenever a full moon is in a certain position. The land and the moon pull at each other, and Earth Pulse energy spills into the sky, turning it red. Yes, and the amount of power is said to create enough mana to affect even an Empyrean. So that's why the ritual is done on a Scarlet Night. But the world of humanity is violent, and the Earth Pulse is stained with all the blood spilled throughout history. So Rokuro's theory might have hit a little closer to the truth than expected. <laughs> oh, a wild guess hits the mark. Don't get used to it. It sure does look grim, though. Yeah. So... Silica is, uh... Also, part of you know me not. Why'd she get killed so easily? Didn't she be like Lafisa, where she's like super powerful? She's also, you know, roaming around with Artorias for a while. Got, you know, some combat experience. Her death kind of doesn't make any sense.
see. Where'd the Markle be? Yep. If I'm in this, I'm in this one. Are we ready for this? Sky's light for God! This armor team resistant everything. And how the fuck do you hurt it? What's your gimmick, buddy? Damage to hurt him? Is that what's going on? Mm, not been hurt yet. Reduce the damage more. There's more art defense. Oh, there. Darkness, spare, kindle a beacon of hope. 
Me, motherfucker. What's it doing more damage now? Put on a bunch of shit to make it do less. I'm gonna need specialized gear to take this thing down. Reflecting damage is the only thing I can think of to make him get hurt. First, I need to be strong enough to fuck that damage. I'm gonna have to come back. So hold on to any static damage reduction. Need to get another 60 or so. Or I could grind stuff until I get enough gear and levels. Kind of annoying way to go about it. And the carry on is normal. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Earth pulse flowing inside it. It looks like we can reach the core from there. I put anything on her that she has a max. No. It's a good thing I put all the defense things on her. I mean, I put all the the red plants on her, but that makes it a little more surmountable. All right, Velvet. I think it's time you let us in on your plan for how we escape if and when the volcano erupts. There is Run. no plan. Oh, what? And even if we awaken the elemental Empyreans, we're still toast. I'm not going to die. For you, but what about the rest of us? I'm sure you'll all make it. Don't you think you're being a bit blithe? I doubt there'll be an eruption at all. We'll only be using the volcano's life spring to push souls into the earth pulse. I don't think that should have much of an impact on the volcano's activity itself. Well, if you say so, that's well, the a earth up. and fire Empyreans Aye. team up to make it but blow the up. The ancients also say that when the four Empyreans awaken, there's a great shift in the earth. If they're angry about being roused from their slumber, I don't think a volcanic eruption is something we can rule out. See? What did I tell you? Really, I'm sure we'll be fine. If the volcano erupts, we'll just deal with it. <laughs> You're starting to sound like Velvet. <laughs> you look sure of yourself, but I'm still nervous. It may be best to write up a will. Aizen, do you have a pen and paper? Yeah, but I'm using them. <laughs> That's enough. 
You already know how this will turn out, right? Oh, so you figured that out. It wasn't hard. Besides, it's not like you have anyone to give a will to. Oof, way to cut to the quick. Okay, new enemies. Oh, hello. You're looking at one, get surrounded by two. Welcome to the volcano. Oh, hey, I'm not in there, nice. Like, why am I getting stunned? Okay. Don't let me miss the guard. See if I care. Cool. Now, even if it did let me miss the guard, it wouldn't fucking matter. There we go. Power. Like healer, dragon. Dragon. Infernal Torah, no, I can't. Wow. Those are dicks. Oh, wow. Four large bottles. I need to go to town. Again? Won't let me cycle my shit. A good thing to mess with. Trouble, 
That's what happens when you go into battle unprepared. We're good until it decided not to listen to my triggers. But that's what happens in this game. Totally know where I'm going.
chance! Wounds that won't shield. Hard to get left. Make the pay! Now pick that! Devour! Pick that! Devour! Come on! Drop strike! Pick that! Devour! I wish I had power like that. Get those phantom inputs. We will need to be extremely wary. Wounds that won't shield. Far from the flesh. Make the pay! Crushing wind! Take that! Devour! Right now! Run it! Run it! Lock it right now! Or something fell off.
I'm f freezing. You're so strong. But I'm stronger. Sleep. If you fall asleep, we're leaving you. I got you. Dark and light. I got you. Come on. Did not tell you that. Not yet. Ah. Nothing in here. He's faster than me. Like 
Trying to run from the bugs because apparently they're faster. Spinning with the little spell in the way. Kill steal me, motherfucker. Needed that soul. Fast enemy is also the easy one. Ah, oh, shit. Alright, here we go. Yeah. I got you! 
All right, can't really defend that. Try to survive. Eighty nine. Just wanted to see what level it was. No mercy. Wounds I won't heal. Hard to collect. Make the pay. Take that. Devour. Too close. Feeling strange. Devour. Too close. Cigar, come on. Great if the controls work. I can't die here. And uh, I can't miss the guard because that took away my meter. I'm just careless. I can't die here. Come here, buddy. Did you think you could escape me? So, bunch of forty-eights versus an eighty-nine. Not so bad. Good luck. Show him. Oh, part a little at the end. Or that I did good. Am I going backwards or forwards? Uh, my sense of direction is fucked. Alright, they're faster than me. I don't think we have a chance. Almost got back at that. Down. 
You'll be facing Shigure soon. Yeah, not long now. I know this is a weird time to bring this up, Lafayette, but there's something I've been meaning to ask you. All right, ask away. I knew you'd say that. So, uh, how was your bath and Mercio? Huh? You uh, you went in with Velvet, right? Just between us guys. What was it like? Well, what are you getting at, Rogero? Let me in on this too. It'll be our secret. Not you too, Aizen! There's nothing to be ashamed of. There are just certain times in life when you need to find your resolve and seize the opportunity. We just want to know what your resolve got you. Right. It's like a test. Stop it! I didn't go into the bath with her! Now that's a shame. That might have been your one shot. Once you're all grown up, you won't be able to get away with it. That's why I didn't do it. I'm tired of Velvet treating me like a little kid. <laughs> Bravo! <laughs> you passed the test. He's three right. years old. You don't need me to watch over you anymore. Why did you laugh like that? We're just happy that you're growing up. I don't understand you two. If you're just gonna pick on me, go away. <laughs> We're sorry, but I really needed that. Laughter's good for the soul. Rokuro... Were you feeling tense? You wouldn't think it, huh? But now I can fight like I always do. I owe you, Lafayette. Yeah, don't worry about it. Looks like the next test is yours. Yeah. Lafayette, Aizen, watch me prove myself. He's literally three years old. This is his third birthday right now. Mokuro. How do you think Shigure will move against us? He's not really the imaginative type. He'll be out in the open, waiting for us. Howdy, pornographic metro. It's the perfect place for a flanking attack. We don't need to worry about an ambush. Shigure is waiting for us ahead. Well, making it really hard to avoid battles on this little path.
Crash through! Finish! Go ahead! No trouble! Crash through! Like Soaring Dragon! No. Crash through! Soaring Dragon! And down! Like the knee tag! Down! Let's huh. rock! Take that! The power! Crash through! Soaring Dragon! Internal Force! Like the knee tag! No. Finish! Go ahead! Take that! The power! Crash through! Soaring Dragon! Internal Torrent! Finish! Scarlet Edge! No! Take that! Devour! No. Whew! I thought we were done for. Are we ready for this? Let's see if we catch them, might as well get the easy back attack on them. You thought I'd stop there? Annihilating? Crash! That all you got for you? You I'm pretty underleveled, anyways. Little grinding can't hurt. I mean, shit, the last red mark I encountered, I couldn't even hurt him. Come on, really? Wow, really? He's really just waiting for us here? Rokuro? It's Actually, okay. No. I need to kill that last red mark. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I need to kill that red mark before I can do chaos mode. I want to do these fights in chaos mode. I'm going to go back. That I need better gear first. I'm gonna have to farm a little bit. Are we ready for this? Crash through! Soaring Dragon! Finish! Run away! And down! Gaze 
You're not hurt, are you? All your mithril shit. Keep that just because it has attack. Uh, I'm wrong attack, it's better. Thank <laughs> you. 
Can we sell that? No, it's right there. I'm stupid. That didn't really get me closer to my goal. Fucker.
I think I need to go back in the volcano for better loot. on the bugs since they're easy. Didn't find any. There's one. Next to two other things. Are we ready for this? No mercy! You thought I'd stop there? Annihilating? Crash! Out of my way! Take that! The power! Nothing can stop these fists. to that then. Maybe if it would have activated there and I was when I said to. He just stood there doing nothing until he died. He died. Too 
dark despair, kindle a beacon of hope! Running strike! Vanishing thunder! Vanishing back! Devour! Running strike! Finish! Lack of dragon! Flutter! Running strike! Dark despair, kindle a beacon of hope! I said! Light of light! Flutter! 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 Running strike! Light of light! Flutter! Pump blade! Here's <laughs> true! Oh, damn it. I'm trying to get them together for a hard battle. Said you could enter. There's another one right on top of me. Disappeared. We will need to be extremely wary. Wounds I won't shield. Cards in the flesh. Lethal pain. Fighting the power. Got you. Come on. Yeah. Finish. Lethal pain. 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 Lethal
Let me switch up the food I'm eating. I'm all finished. Are we ready for this? Better not hunt me for gear so I can get my damage reduction up so I can do plus damage on that boss. Probably really have the loot food. Why did we try to devour? really hate the phantom inputs in this game. Not mithril. I need mithril. I guess coming up the mountain didn't really help. We will need to be extremely wary. Right, should still be more EXP, and if I get enough EXP, I'll level up to a point where I can take the hits. Healy, Healy, Healy. Did you think you could escape me? Trying to dig how the it has its own built-in chat interface instead of having to get your own custom one like Twitch. It's just convenient. Uh, yeah, it's kind of similar. That of whole active combat system where your allies kind of stand around doing jack shit. Yeah, there's a bunch of there's a bunch of fashion stuff you can do. Like this guy in this costume is not how he normally looks. Yeah. 
And you can also choose the color, like I made it a black cat. By the default, it's a different color. See, by default, let's see, I think it's white. Where is it? Therapy cat, therapy cat. I can't read good. Oh, there it is. Yeah, normally it's white. That thing? Uh, Luffy Repeat? I think that's a, a reference to a different Tales game. Yeah, I like most of them. Except this guy, which is why I put him in this stupid costume. There's a stupid costume like that for all of them. I just only put it on him. And there's a bunch more costume pieces I haven't unlocked. You either have to... All these little orbs I'm collecting, they unlock boxes that have have uh, little pieces in them. Then also coins you collect to buy from a merchant and actually pick what you want. Yeah, they're all earned through the game. Right, what this game does really good is the whole anime style and you know the costume stuff is cool. The big problem with it is in combat, some of the buttons just decide to press themselves or not work when you press them. So that's a big pain in the ass. Yeah. And it's the most important buttons too that tend not to work. If the button I'm using to go into Berserk mode, sometimes it just doesn't work, especially on big bosses. Like, the larger they are, seems, I don't know if the game's lagging up or what the problem is. So the more important the fight, the less it works. That thing there, too, that does that little special move, that tends to not work a lot. I had a match where I counted 20 times in a row where it didn't work. I heard about it from Humble Bundle, which is also where I got this game. Yeah, this is on the monthly Humble. Uh, I got a yearly subscription last month, so I got it for 11 bucks, along with some other games. The other ones this month were, I think, Staxel, which is like Minecraft and Harvest Moon, and uh, Sniper Elite 4. Yeah, it's basically Harvest Moon in a voxel-based world. It actually probably would have been better off as a mod for Minecraft than its own game, but it's still pretty good. And then I haven't jumped into Sniper Elite 4, but I played the first one. Really good, uh, good sniper game. Forgot where you put it? I misplace greenhouses all the time. Oh, 
You miss with that move, it really fucks up the rhythm. It's just a costume. He's an annoying little kid character that I really dislike, so I just put him in that costume because it looks stupid. Also helps with visibility because he's really short. That makes him a lot taller. Actually, that's what he normally looks like there, the second one. The stupid curly hair. Also, the plot in this game has been really predictable, and I've guessed almost everything except for his origin. I fucked up my guess on his origin, so that's another reason I don't like him. I was only half right about what he is. Uh, she's a demon, and that arm she uses to eat other demons. And when you have that arm out, you're immune to status effects and you can't be killed. You'll just go to one life. Yeah, it's like a, it's like the Assassin's Creed blade. Those things have too much life. I'm gonna fight it. Hello, Justin. Justin. You're strong, but I'm stronger. How are Just one through nine doing? Uh, trying to unlock chaos mode in this game. To do it, you have to beat this boss where you have to reflect damage to him. But I don't have enough defense to reflect damage. So, I'm just farming stuff till I get stronger. I'm about to fight all the main bosses of the game, and I want to fight them on the hardest mode. I've skipped almost every random encounter I could, so I'm way, way low on uh, everything. Uh, no, I would say this is the worst of the Tales games. The plot is super predictable, the combat is wonky as shit. 
Uh, it's got the most annoying character of any Tales game, including that goddamn Cheagle from Abyss. Oh, come on, I was blocking. Luckily, the character that's super, super annoying is a minor character. So you don't really have to see them too much. What level are you? 94. So I'm like level 49, put in the 94, why not? Yeah, this is a basically a special encounter where if you score a high enough score, it brings you a dire foe, which is really difficult. And I've already beat this thing twice, but it gets stronger each time you fight it. So, this is the third level of it. And of the dire foes, it's the strongest dire foe in the game. There's five of them, and this is the strongest. But I've mostly got his attack patterns down. The problem is the fucking invincible teammates he has. You can't hurt those warthogs that are following him around. Or trickle boars. So when they got you in a corner like this, you know, all you can do is sit there and defend until they go away. Except that sometimes it decides you're not holding block even though you clearly are. Like, just there. That little fly-by move he just did is an instant kill if you don't go into berserk mode as soon as he tries to fly through you. And it can hit multiple people, so if it hits you and your party, you can really get fucked by it. Speaking of which, someone needs to pick him off the floor. I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh, thanks for not finishing me off. Totally could have. Oh, I 
That was a bad time to be stunned. Can't I hear? Dark despair. Yeah, Half-Life and Quarter-Life, things like this tend to get new moves. Like that beam he just did at me. And I didn't block that time. Hope that's a finisher. You get extra loot when you finish with that move. So that is definitely good to do on a boss. Really? Only two items? Uh, at least it's a new item. Still. Those things usually drop like ten items. I save after that. Scout. You're strong, but I'm strong. <laughs> This fight is over. Astute observation. The fight was indeed over. Are we ready for this? No mercy! 
Wounds that won't heal. Cards in the flesh. Lethal pain! Did you think you could escape me? We will need to be extremely wary. Fucked up. Disgraceful. Yes, it was. Blades of wind, slice them. Mm, someone picked that up. Wow. Well, oh, that was dumb. Disgraceful. Through trouble, receive my 
wanted to pick up the souls and didn't really pay attention to anything else. Didn't even see him. He threw the other guy. Thanks. Forget the Draws of Auburn. Hot swarm. Hello there. Hey, good Forget the wolves first. Katie Lou. Clear it out. We'll go back to town. Oh, how did I miss that? I've walked past it three, four times now. Oh, your mithril. <laughs> Uranus.
Only topaz. For all that, I'm no closer to my goal. I didn't get any tempering powder. I'll get some more fragments. Something right in front of me, but it's trying to attack something else. This swings in the middle of nowhere. Where in the world do you hide all of that paper? Here. And here. He's taking it all off! You're strong, but I'm stronger. <laughs> Come on, really? 
level am I now? 51. You're strong, but not strong. Kill them to the bone! You won't get away! Finished here. Let's go. We will need to be extremely wary. better. We will need to kill ass from the space. I thought I was getting a back attack on him. No mercy! Wounds I won't shield! Cards in the flesh! Thank <laughs> you. 
No one is injured. Bats are annoying. I'm not fighting you. We will need to be extremely wary. No mercy! Wounds I won't heal. Cards in the flesh. Make them pay! Is that all 
We're finished here. I don't think we have a chance! The power! Strike! Strike! No mercy! Wounds that won't heal! Carve the flesh! Lethal pain! Take these fucking bats! It is moved too quick! And their stun's hard to avoid! I don't mind them so much when they're on the ground. And they're running around, it's a pain in the ass. I want some powder. Give me powder. Kiss. We will need to be extremely wary. Take that! 
I need to step away for a minute. Because real life is calling, which I'm not a fan of, the whole real life thing. But it called, literally. <laughs> 